Hi everyone, so today we'll be seeing the metabolism of paracetamol or known as estaminophen. This would be the basic structure of an estaminophen. First of all, we, we must know that estaminophen undergoes two pathways. One would be the conjugation pathway where the estaminophen will be converted into sulfate moiety which is a non-toxic drug. The second one where the estaminophen would be metabolized in the liver and it has to undergo cytochrome P450 to form an acetyl-liminoquinone or known as an acetyl p benzoquinone imine. This n acetyl p benzoquinone imine is also known as NAPK. It's a toxic metabolite in our body. In order, in order to our body to metabolize it, it has to use the glutathione which helps to convert the drug to cysteine conjugates and also mercaptic acid. These both these mercaptic acid and cysteine conjugates are non-toxic. If our body has an has taken an excessive uh, an excessive amount of estaminophen, then our body will be undergoing a depletion of hepatic hepatic glutathione, which means it allows the thiol neutrophilic to attack on the reactive quinone. When this happens, then we will be undergoing hepatic necrosis or renal failure. Hepatic necrosis means it causes an elevation of liver function and also an increase in EST and ALT level. But this overdosing can also be reverted by using its antidote and acetylcysteine. So this is the paracetamol metabolism. I hope you understand and thank you.